Hi guys, this is App Unwrapper. I'm back with Hades on iOS. And I'm gonna pick up where I left off. For you, mate. Thought you might get a kick out of this. For me, pal? Awful nice of you, just awful nice. But guess what? I got this for you. Tit for tat, you understand? It deals the deal. Cheers, mate. I didn't mean to do that. There's an accident. Hitting the wild out there, boyo? Hey, I know the feeling. You just keep at it, though. You're getting tougher, getting smarter. Between the two of those, I'm thinking you'll pull through soon enough here. Appreciate it, Skelly. What's this one do? Hmm. So this gives 38. Why up to 50? Let's try this. Should help. All right, let's go with this. Thing. It's time, Baratha. I'm ready. Poseidon, it's been excellent to know you, sir, so please, this is for you. Oh, I'm positively moved by your affection, little nephew. Although I think I've just the thing for you in turn. Here, I shall transfer it to you. I thank you, Uncle. tell you something, little Hades. My relatives and I, we've been holding back one of our greatest gifts to see if you were worthy. And you are. My aid is yours. So call me if you need anything, especially to smash your enemies to bits. Oh, what's this? Hmm. Poseidon at my beck and call. That's cool. Stones. I'll take them. Okay. Like that. Can't use my goblet here. I mean, my potion. Hmm.
Thanks, Daedalus. that that is an ominous looking portal on the ground right there so all I need to do is sacrifice some of my life essence to go in here oh, I don't see why not who or what is that Within the underworld's quietest, most solitary, darkest abyss lies hidden evidence of the beginning of all things, of chaos, the most ancient sculptor that has shaped this world. I'd best take all the evidence I find. <laughs> This is not someone I recognize. So, in the name of Hades, um, hello, may I ask who's calling? Um, have we met? Oh, we have met in a way. I know everybody here and there. You wish to leave this place? Then it is my wish to make your doing so a little bit more interesting. And if you encounter the other beings someday, do give them my regards. Interesting. to extract the benefits a few chambers from now. Hello. Hey, sir. Within the depths of Tartarus reside the most wretched of all the shades who linger for eternity within the underworld, whose lord and master is especially unkind to those attempting to cheat death. Lots of wretchedness to go around, I guess. Hmm. Hey, sir. Thought this might ease your burden for a while. Now, hold a moment, Highness. I cannot accept something like this. Not without giving back a little something in return, that is. Thanks for that, sir. You know, Prince Ed, I'd not expected to run into you again, not after all this time. Something I missed down in the house, or what? Not had much company of late, is all. Well, something's just about always a mess back home, sir. Figured it couldn't hurt to check up on things in Tartarus a bit more frequently. Well, I am grateful for it, I and the old boulder there, in turn. I'm used to going lengthy stretches on my own, but having visitors from time to time would do me well. Certainly, Highness. Thanks. Nice. Good luck out there. Come on. Surprise.
Phew. Ooh, free thing. A fountain chamber. Let's see. You blundered headlong into danger for the past six chambers or more. And you made such a racket, I could almost hear it from Olympus. I have to say your hunting skills are rather unconventional. Oh no, I don't have enough gold for anything. I've got to say, you are a sight for sore eyes there, Charon. So, uh, looks like you're selling, is that it? You come to help me out? Brilliant. A curse of chaos has been lifted. You and me. Oh, God. of Artemis, correct, nephew? She shies away from most of us, so if she's taken somewhat of a liking to you, great. Hmm. I have a gold gal? God, oh, god gal. Gage. I am almost dead. Oh God. God. Ha. Ah. Right. What's that? Uh-oh. You lot, huh? They have their chance. 
peace and quiet. And my keep. I'll hang on to these. Whew. More louts? Good enough to eat. Juicy. I don't want to fight her. Don't make me fight her. Hey there, Meg. <laughs> Hold it, Zagreus. I sense something. Is that? Ah. Uh, you've been in contact with Chaos. So even they are now involved with this. Just because Chaos is giving me the power to crush you doesn't mean they're getting involved with this, does it? You don't know who or what you're dealing with. Ask Nix about them for me sometime. Here, I'll give you a chance to ask her very soon. and to that glowy purple whip she's always threatening me with whenever I try to talk to her. I get it. Mm. Oh, shame. There's quite a lot of renovating to be done, isn't there, Father? Your house contractor there has shown a wide variety of pending jobs. I've ordered Nix to supervise that list. Entirely her problem, boy. And likely yours. How does it feel? Knowing that your rampage has created the need for so much maintenance. Feels pretty good now that you mention it. Keeps everybody occupied now. Go occupy yourself someplace else. Mm. Achilles, did you ever used to pray to the gods? Make offerings to them and such back when you were alive? I prayed mostly to my mother, lad. I always had my doubts the gods were listening. That they could even hear. Though I suppose that if you make an offering, they might be so inclined. Just for the moment, anyway. They're helping much. They're helping, definitely, sir. I grant you funding and autonomy to do this job upon your earliest convenience, contractor. Go practice your declaiming someplace else.
Oh, um, so, hi, Prince. So, is there anything I can get you? Or maybe tidy up some more? Or I just thought maybe you'd like something to drink sometime? Oh, a uh, drink sometime sounds wonderful, Dusa. Maybe tomorrow, assuming I'm not getting out of here by then? Well, I mean, it's no big deal. I mean, forget I asked. Or anything. I'm sorry. Bye. Dusa? Achilles in the spotlight. What's for sale? The Olympians can't really see me, can they, Nix? I mean, not very well. I get that they can sense details here and there, but they don't know the full extent of what's going on. Are we really so far beyond their influence? You are enshrouded from them, child. For your own benefit, and theirs. They know as much as necessary to assist. And I trust they shall, for as long as you require. They are bound to one another as family. And they know that you require aid. Do not be too prideful to accept. I won't. Hey, I know you. Hey. I forgot how to access my prophecies. Oh, right, here. The fated list of mine and prophecies. See. Nothing. Can't afford anything. Hey, back, huh? Let me give you a piece of advice, boy. Yo, you run across a guy like me out there, you just give him a good stab right in the back without a second thought before he sends you crying back to Papa. I'll keep that in mind, mate. Excellent. Take a break. Ow, nice. I like a quick stabby stabby. Almost felt that. Changes. Let's go, Coronacht. Bye, everyone.
quite the bow. Be golden ones, right? God, that was not good. Okay. with that Fury Megara. Is that her name? Now, isn't she a real firebrand? Maybe this will help you out next time you meet. Give me some gold. Like this weapon anymore. Power of Olympus. Powered up.
that something? Okay. Stressful. I'll take this one. Let me see. Escape. Seeker. I never took you for an archer, though the power of that bow is undeniable. Use it wisely. Divine protection. I'll take what's mine. Do not so much as think about it. Father. Okay. Phew. What is it now? If I can take a minute of your time. Thank <laughs> you. 
Phew. Worthless. There we go. Got it. Ooh. I forgot that foes can drop food now. Oh, that has gold, okay. What is happening? Enough. Colorful. I don't know what was happening there. This stuff. Oh, my Lord. Charon's shop. Thank you, mate. Charon, mate. Now, hypothetically, if I provided you with, say, a thousand coins, would you be willing to give me a ride in your beautiful boat? Upriver, I should say, specifically. I had to ask. Yeah, this isn't gonna go well.
I'm not looking forward to this. Can't get rid of me, Meg. <laughs> and there you are again. Lord Hades ought to lock you up rather than let you run amok in his domain like this. I'm sure he'd welcome all this feedback from you, Meg. Or maybe you're just pining for my father's job. I have no envy for your father's position. Besides, I happen to enjoy my own responsibilities. There. Yeah, that was not gonna go well. You just can't take a hand. Oh, you win this round, Meg. What? Uh, oh! Huh. Wow, you've died at least five times so far, I think. Dying's good for the whole ecosystem down here, so, uh, thanks! You're helping make the underworld a better place! Great. Just keep dying over and over and everything will be fine. No, oh, it's only you. Have you yet satisfied your foolish urges? Perhaps a lashing from the Furies' whips would set you straight. I had it out with them already, thanks. Such nonsense. First you defy me openly, and now you lie. On my next meeting with the Furies, we'll have a word about all this, you rest assured. Wish I could be there to see your face. <laughs> Cerberus acknowledges the prince with an affection tempered well with time. Goodbye for now. Oh. I got an achievement. Um, Achilles, sir, there's something I've been wondering about your codex. The words are yours, and yet it's through my actions that I'm able to absorb them. Is that how mortal scriptures always work? Ah. You have to understand, lad. I've been here in your father's realm for quite some time. My documented learnings became bound to me, much like the spear, you see. You can undo those bindings over time. Thus, my knowledge can be yours, whatever it amounts to. I see. I think. I'm grateful for it, sir. What is it, child? Is something amiss? No, it's just the latest renovations from the contract. I... Father told me you've been supervising all of that. Look, just between us, and I'll not speak of it again, but thanks so much. Ah. Yes, no need to speak of it again, though I am pleased to oblige. Too pricey for me. Can't buy that. Um, Nix, you've done so much for me, I thought you might like this. You know your father does not like it when nectar is doled out on the premises, dear child. However, I am not he, and I wished regardless to provide you a token of my affection. I'm very grateful, Nix. I want to go lie down. Let's have a look at the old fated list.
It is the dead of night, or the approximation of it in the realm of Hades. Prince of the Underworld, Zagreus, rises from a fitful slumber, with much mischief on his mind. Mischief? Me? I was just going to have a little look through Father's stuff. All is quiet at this time. Ever-dreaming Hypnos put a spell upon the house, as Willful Zagreus had asked of him. All are fast asleep, save for the prince. It is exactly as he planned. Mm. Lower your voice, old man. I'm trying to be sneaky here. ventures toward the stately throne of his lord father, half expecting to be caught, but ill expecting what he is about to find. I said shut up, old man. He does not know exactly what he seeks. He only knows that something always has felt off to him, that he does not belong. Who is he, really? Lord Hades never would indulge such questions. So Prince Zagreus would find out for himself. I'm not listening. He rifles through his Lord Father's possessions. There is not much of any import there. Ledgers and administrative parchment work. Correspondence from Olympus which he had ignored. No trace of any reference to his son. Then, there is the note, written finally in a hand and voice the likes of which the prince had never seen or heard. Hades, I can no longer tolerate my life here in this place, so I'm leaving, even if it kills me. I won't be returning to Olympus. If there is a place where I belong in this world, it must be somewhere between heaven and hell. Perhaps it's on the coast and has a little garden. Take care of Cerberus. I shall miss him. Thus did Prince of the Underworld Zagreus absorb the contents of this hidden letter, written in his mother's hand. His mother's hand? My mother's hand? Wait, what? You're saying this Persephone, that she's my mother? But... but Father always said that Nyx was m That liar. He lied to me. They both did. All my life. Uh, thus did the prince discover, inadvertently, the well-kept truth about his lineage. Entirely by chance, this did occur. <laughs> Persephone, the one-time queen of all the underworld. Where had she gone? And why? Engulfed by newfound questions and his rage, the prince decided to confront his lord and master. <sighs> you... why? You... you're... Nix, you're not my mother. All this time, you and my father, you... You lied to me? Oh, my dear child. So now you know. So now you know. But only half the truth. I can explain the rest, so... Please. It never was my wish to hurt you. Mother, I wonder, will you even remember me? Back to normal. Come, Shades, I don't have all night. Skelly. Oh, 
can't sleep when I'm dead. You're getting pretty strong, I'll give you that, boyo. Strong enough to smack a guy like me right up against the wall, and I'd go straight to pieces. Boom! You just remember, when you're duking it out, the walls are your friend. Smack guys against walls. Sound advice as ever, mate. Let's go with this one. Hey, that looks pretty mean. that one do? Alright, I'm gonna take a break here. Alright, so that is Hades on Netflix. Check it out. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye-bye.